What's up, y'all? It's March 23rd, 2022. Uh, this is FDE. It's going to be a pretty quick video. Going to touch on a couple things and then really talk about this Hype Beast project. I saw something about it a couple weeks ago, maybe a week ago, but didn't really look into it. But today I caught like the end of a Twitter space uh, where Cypher Kicks was speaking about it. And it uh, piqued my interest, so I looked into it some more, and we'll get into that in a second. Uh, I just want to start with Old Money here. This is my favorite nft project probably what i think is the best nft project ever it's a satirical take on the u.s dollar losing value consistently over time like it's it's great just look into it if you haven't um i just want to touch on there just the floor and just the, the recent volume like we've been booming like crazy uh we had a 33,333 ada bill sale yesterday i think it was on the second rank bill in the collection um so yeah things have been moving for old money floor is almost 408 on the bills i uh, just wanted to touch on that real quick i will make a video in the future going into more detail on the project but it is very in depth so i need to make an outline and just make sure i don't miss anything when covering it um what else oh yeah fun plastic um benjamin's group is now on cnft.tools and uh, I don't know if a lot of people know this, but you can connect your wallet to cnft.tools. Um, you got to join their Discord and register via the Discord bot. But once you register, you can pull up any project and just hit this wallet uh, uh, ticker here. And uh, yeah, it'll pull up everything you own from that project in that wallet. So I hatched 12 out of my 52 eggs so far. And okay nice i checked these earlier and these were like in the 300s okay so i got two top 250s right there 350 got some decent, decent rankings so these all change because they they change as the eggs are hatched so until all eggs are hatched the rarity is not 100 percent final as far as you know the order and ranking um so these will be pretty dynamic until all eggs are hatched but that's cool to see that you know i got some lower rankings than i thought i initially had uh, which weren't bad to begin with you know 300 out of 10,000 ain't bad at all i uh, just wanted to point that out there though that you know these are now on cnft.tools for easier ranking and it doesn't show the eggs so you don't have to like ignore or you know skip through the eggs like you would on jungle um but yeah that's just you know for your convenience just to put that out there let people know with this this is really what the video is about um this hype beast project let me just go back to the main page it's by Cypher Kicks, you know, said so presents Hype Beast. Collection drop March 31st, 2022. It's an airdrop for all Cypher Kicks holders. I think seasons one through five total up to 5,000 pairs. And uh, all holders will get, you know, one airdrop per pair of uh, Cypher Kicks. And these will be unrevealed airdrops, so you won't know, you know, what they look like until April is saying. Um, they're going to have a marketplace online where you can actually upgrade these buy clothes and accessories they're doing collaborations with um, you know other projects on cardano such as ugly bros pixels and disco solaris uh so yeah like right here they say wearable marketplace the hype beast store will allow holders to customize their clothes and items on their hype beast nft uh official hype beast merch will be, re will be released soon after the initial drop they will be at cnft con in uh, october and then they got you know the collaborations uh if you go to the buy page it tells you you know to obtain a hype beast nft via airdrop for free you must hold a cypher kicks nft before the snapshot on march 28th so that's in five days uh if you're watching this you know on the 23rd uh you hold your cypher kicks nft by that date to receive a free hype beast nft on march 31st so the 31st is when the airdrop will actually happen and you can go to jpeg to, you know grab uh, some cypher kicks nfts if you want to partake in that i grabbed one pair earlier i want to grab a couple more but uh <laughs> probably gonna sound hella irresponsible they're like i don't know but all my liquidity is locked up in men swap and men swap is a down for maintenance and they have them for like 24 hours so i can't buy any more uh cypher kicks right now but <laughs> once i get my eight out of men swap i do plan on grabbing a few more so yeah, they'll be airdrop for free, one-to-one -one ratio. So that means you'll get one for every 
you know cypher that you own doesn't it's not one per wallet or anything like that um, 5,000 total and they are all unrevealed so you know if, a lot of people on Cardano may not be familiar with reveals for NFTs, but it's common practice on Ethereum. And um, if you, you know, were part of the Benjamin's Group Egg Project Ev Evolution, it um, revealed to fund plastic. So I think that was like the first big reveal on Cardano. Um, I know Cycler will have the Rider reveal uh, when those are complete in a few months. So it's, I think it's going to be a more of a common common practice, um, you know, coming up. Yeah, so we should get the reveals in April of 2022 on these. On March 31st, we'll get, I guess this is the unreveal, what it'll look like, maybe. Um, so they'll all look like this, I'm assuming. I guess. Um, but they'll all look the same. It'll all be the same image with no meta metadata other than, like, just saying, you know, what drop it is and whatnot. But it won't have the specific metadata for your NFT until the reveal happens um and then they're saying the wearables marketplace will be released in quarter two of 2022 this is just kind of a little preview of that you know, how it'll look no prices up but just you know it'll show the price what the item is and it's a silhouette of the nft so you can see how it'll look on yours uh about rarities they say they are introducing dynamic rarity since so you'll be able to upgrade the items that your hype beast wears their rarities will change we will set up a set of rules that will allow holders to understand how upgrading their hype beast nfts will affect their rarity and ranking in the collection okay that makes sense you know since you can buy a rare item for your nft that would make it more rare that's kind of like old money got a similar system going on you can't actually change the nft itself but they do have a mf -er ranking and uh that's kind of a dynamic ranking based on you know what interactions the bills have gone through sometimes they're using auctions sometimes they're you know they might have been part of the secret message for the vault or you know being sold in the aftermarket different things like that and you can see the history of it um but that'll be some more stuff i get into on the old money videos uh but yeah so uh last with this uh why are some hype beasts not human there are different types of hype beasts including humans zombies statues cyborgs blue lizards green lizards and ghosts you will not be able to change the type of hype beast you own so that will be the true rarity since you can change the items that they wear but you can't change the you know actual skin i guess of the nft so i'm sure some of these will be more rare than others um but yeah that's a uh, hype beast by cypher kicks i would say grab you some cypher kicks by march 28th if you want to partake in this airdrop i plan on grabbing a few more uh let me know what you think in the comments like subscribe give me a follow or no that's that's a subscribe never mind uh like subscribe and yeah i'll catch y'all next time